Do you ever get a pot full of inspirational ideas just popcorning all over the place? They're great and wonderful and you don't want to forget them, so you write them down somewhere, anywhere. Maybe in a random notebook or on a piece of paper, on a post-it, or maybe you type them up on your computer or you dictate them onto your phone. And so later, when you have a spare moment to work on one of those grand ideas, well, you can't find it anywhere. What was that idea again? Or where did I put it? What file or folder? What book or paper? Hi there, I'm Agnès de Biznac, an artist from France. Apart from doing art and teaching, something within me loves to organize and plan and set things up. So this is the part of me that you'll get to see today in this class. But I also got into a chaotic mess once upon a time with all those great ideas flying all over the place until I realized that all that just took up so much mental space and brain energy that I could be instead using up on focusing on those creative ideas or on the project that needed to get done. So today I work very differently, of course, after many trials and fails on the way, but I think that's what's led me to be so crazy about organization. And so today I'm going to share with you one cool organizational tip that has worked really well for me and still continues to work for me today as I create courses or maybe start on a book project or illustrate a children's book. I might even use these ideas for a big home project a renovating project, a decluttering project. Most of all, it's just categorizing all those wonderful, great ideas and inspirations. Having a place where you can put it all and see it, visualize it all into one place. Instead of my mind going a little bit all over the place, with just a little time of planning and organizing and prioritizing, you'll notice that you'll get all those ideas just working in perfect harmony. So let's get started on this colorful, artsy organizing. I'll see you in class.